Hello everybody and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth last run until I'm back from Sweden so you won't see any Isaacs for a few days I'm sorry it's just how it has to be but it's still got some really cool stuff coming up on the channel oh damn it Lazarus we just had a Lazarus run but whatever it's fine Lazarus is Lazarus uh, paralysis is not a bad pill but yeah you know it is what it is you can't really complain come on give me like I, I, I don't oh, we're gonna do this we're gonna do this right there yes Wow, that's perfect. I'm so freaking happy I did that. All right, here is your look at our seed. Uh, I'm so happy I got the troll bomb to work there. Still probably going to end up uh, killing ourselves as Lazarus. Um, we did lose our eternal heart, but that's fine. It sucks, but the, the real good thing is that we got the flying for free, and uh, that is key. So good. I'm happy. That's a very, very solid start as our Lazarus run. Uh, what do I think about Lazarus? I've talked about it before. I'll talk about it. Hey, Gimpy's not terrible. Uh, I'll talk about it again. He's kind of a boring character. Uh, if you kill him off and, and bring him back to life quickly thereafter, I mean, there is some benefit to that, obviously. Um, and it makes him a bit of a better character and, and more a little bit more fun to play as. Uh, but he's, you know, he's, just, he's, he's up there. He ranks just above Maggie. Um, he looks boring, he's just not an exciting character as far as, like, items or stats are concerned. At least with, like, Samson, he has a unique mechanic. Eve has a, albeit risky, but ne uh, unique mechanic. And even Isaac has a unique mechanic with his D6. Um, then, of course, Azazel's just overpowered as hell. And you have, uh, then you have... I'm missing one. I'm missing one. Oh, Blue Baby. Blue Baby's kind of weird in himself, and the Loss can fuck himself. But yeah, Lazarus is, like, one of the two boring characters in the game. Oh well, what are you gonna do? So we're gonna end up having a Larry Jr. fight, and if we have ourselves a, uh, a health upgrade, which I assume we will, we'll just go ahead and murder our, our own selves and come back uh, a little bit better off. A little bit more damaging, a little bit better in, uh, just in gameplay overall. I appreciate that half a heart, not like I'm gonna need it, but I appreciate it. Another half a heart to be dropped, you're just dropping half a heart, it's like it's your goddamn job, Larry Jr. I appreciate it, looking out for me. It's kind of strange. You know, Larry Juno will be looking out for me like that, but hey, do what you gotta do. I, I never really paid attention, but like his backside, the last lump on his backside has an X where his butt is. Growth hormones. Do I kill myself? Let's think. I mean, I have to take growth hormones either way. I don't know why I'm, I'm stopping taking growth hormones. Uh, it's a good grab. It's a very good damage up. Um, the speed upgrade is nice, but do I kill myself and come back? I was hoping maybe we'd come across a, uh, a Tinted Rock. Doesn't look like that's gonna happen. Wait a minute. Oh, one of these is a shop, one of these is a library. Well, we found the shop. I'm actually gonna bomb this and hope that the library is gonna be good. I'll buy the key and I'm, I'm hoping it's a library in general. It might not be a library, but we have flying, so that means whatever it has might be good. Heh. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come back, baby. Come back to me, Lazarus. Alright, so we're doing a little bit more damage. Let's get this out of our rotation. Uh, telepathy for dummies. Book of Revelations. We could kick carry around for the Meat Boy chance. I think we do it. So we'll take one of these. We'll take one of these down to the next floor. We're a little bit stronger. We have a little bit of a defensive ability now. And I'm feeling okay about this run. So far. I'm glad it was a library. I'm glad I bombed the donation machine. I don't like bombing the donation machine, but I'm glad I did it. Uh, let's go ahead and pop this. And now we're going to be doing some really good damage. Um, I expect to be doing some uh, quick, making quick work rather of a lot of these early rooms, especially on basement with, what, no curse. So I don't expect to have to put too much work behind it all. And we did get a key right away, so we can actually go ahead into here, and that's Trail of Tears. Trail of Tears is not that great, but it's an okay passive item. And that's amazing. Wow, that is so good! Stigmata, very rarely do you, do you are able to make that work. And I'm glad we were able to make that work. Oh, shit. Everybody needs to chill the fuck out over here. Everybody's getting a little too excited. I don't think pill's gonna be very good, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Wow. Suddenly this run turned into a magnificent one. Jesus, man. How quickly the tables can turn. Uh, I will take Swallow Penny. No reason not to. We'll definitely go into our... 
Nice. We'll definitely go into our shop. We have the money to make it worth it. I'm paid out with an extra bomb. Oh, man. I'm, I'm a little nervous that this, this run is suddenly balling out of control really quickly like this. I do not want to take that, so I will take this and this. Move on from this. But, yeah, it's slow. It's getting out of control very quickly. It's kind of bananas, but, hey, whatever. It is what it is. I'm, I'm all right with it. Just try not to think about it. I think I just touched him, and I didn't take any damage. I touched the poop, but I didn't take any damage. Touching the dingle. Um, let's go try to get one more spirit heart. And I'm hoping we get a famine fight. I don't know if we will. I mean, the, the Meat Boy dream may or may not be real. It'd be amazing to get the Meat Boy thing out of the way, though. To not have to think about it. Another one of those achievements towards the real Platinum God to, to be rid of. Uh, sloth fight's always welcome in my book. Sloth is fun. He's easy. Uh, Bob's rotten head is real bad. We're gonna get rid of it. Pick it up. I was hoping we might have gotten ourselves a secret room there. How many bombs do we have? Two? We could look for a secret room if we really wanted to. I appreciate the key and the money. Where else could... There's only what? No, there's two places our secret room could be. Let's try here. Alright. I guess it's gonna be here. Ooh, um, I'm sorry? Where else could it be? Okay. Well, let's go fight our boss then. Ooh, it is famine. Now the question is, are we going to get a cube of meat? That's the other problem, right? Yeah, could get a going to have to get a cube of meat in all this. I think we still need level 4 bandage girl too, though. I don't know. He's blue famine, so he should drop us a spirit heart after. So a deal with the devil is going to be a little bit more feasible than usual. Just because we'll have that extra health to back up having spent the hearts. Let's see if the ball and out of control can maintain. So it is unfortunately going to be ball bandages, but that's okay. Book of Belial. Book of Belial. Guarantees deals with the devils from now on. We'll lose our defensive capabilities of Book of Revelations. I think I need to keep Book of Revelations, but I'm going to pick it up and put it down to maintain a deal with the devil precedent. I do want to see if I can get level 4 bandage girl. I don't think I've unlocked that achievement yet. I think I've gotten to level 3, but not level 4. So if we can make that happen, I'm happy. Because I think that's another achievement I need to achieve, right? Pretty sure that's something I need to do. Who knows? Maybe I'm just crazy. It's possible. Wouldn't put it out of anybody's reach. Alright, come on. Come on. How many more? I'll say, how many more times do I need to hit you before you blow up? Let me get rid of you now. Thank you. Put a bomb down on the tinted rock. Ooh, ooh, tempting. Yeah, we'll do it with a couple keys popping there. Uh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> payout, aka it was a shitty payout. Oh well. What do we got? 48 hour energy. Alright. That's what, three spirit hearts? Jesus. Doesn't happen very often like that. I appreciate it though. And we just finish you off and we'll be good. Find our item room and get to the boss room and at this rate we have a very good chance of even coming across uh boss rush room if we keep on at this pace. I never gun for boss rush room, but if it's on the table, you know, if we're we're doing so well that I can think about it, I'm in a happy place. Let's go ahead and pop this. Heard a spider spawn. So we what? Use the goddamn freaking Book of Revelations three times, four times in this room? Come on. Just get rid of one of them. Thank you. Come on. Nope. Ooh, five cents. One, immediately making the shop viable. Uh, it's good to know that room exists, I guess. This should be a nice quick room. Three shots for the regular ones is fine. Can't really take any damage on this room. If I take damage, I'm real bad. Lots of places to hide with flying. I'm so happy I got fate early. I hope you guys are playing along and, and had some fun with this seed. This is a good one, man. This is one of the ones that you should have fun with. It makes a Lazarus run kind of meh. I mean, kind of fun, rather. Not meh. Uh, the, the opposite of meh. Uh, this is a fucking terrible item. Pick it up, put it down, be done with it. I don't even want to think about it. You know what? You don't even exist in my mind, Mr. Boom. You're long gone. Thank you for showing up early so I don't have to deal with your ass ever again. Dead bird foot. Man, no thanks. So we got tarot cards. 
I don't want him. So I'll just take the spirit heart. And I'll just go. Thought about picking up the key, but we have three keys. And I, I kind of want to hold my money in case the next floor ends up being well, well worth it for us as far as uh, shop items are concerned. Still plenty of things I need to buy in the shop. Hi. I also need to keep on donating too. So the more money I hold on to and the more I can donate later. And all that will end up paying off for us. Alright, we got a pestilence fight right early. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep puking at me. It's fine. So we're going to have level 2 meat girl. Meat girl. Uh, bandage girl. Which is, you know, charm tears is good. A little bit of a damage up in its own right. I appreciate that. I'm sorry. I didn't know you could shoot that fucking directly. God damn. That scared the shit out of me. Okay. Oh, shit. Alright. What? No deal with the fucking devil. That's some bullshit. Ah, oh, that sucks. All right, we don't have to worry about a horseman fight on this floor. Okay. No, I don't want the rosary. We don't have. We have the spirit hearts. I don't. I don't want faith up, which guarantees the rosary would guarantee a Bible to show up. Usually, I would take the rosary. The rosary is not a terrible item. It's good defensively. Get a little bit of spirit hearts out of it. And, you just hope that the Bible shows up on the shop and you can ignore it and not in the item room or anything else. Um, but it's still not great. And, and if I have the opportunity to pass it up like I don't need it, there's no reason for me to take it. So I might as well just not. We have a golden key, which is why I came back here to see what this is all about. And I appreciate the uh, the bombs payout there. Kind of crazy amount of bombs that they decided to give me. This room is kind of bad. Could you not spawn any spiders? I would appreciate that greatly. Okay, I'm I thought he was gonna turn into like the goop form. That's what it looked like to me. Apparently I was incredibly wrong. So we'll get a real deal with the, not deal with the devil, real boss item here because we're not gonna be dealing with uh, any of the horsemen. Nice easy room. We've been lucky as far as the room generation has been concerned as well. Had to take a look over to make sure that we we're actually playing on hard mode because I feel like We've been getting the easy floors with minimal, like, minimally annoying curses. Everything's just been going real well. Which is kind of rare and weird. We'll definitely go in here. Spend a half a spirit heart. See if we can pull something out. Come on, baby. Give me something good. Penny's not exactly what I would call good. Gimpy did not pay out. I was kind of hoping... Uh, I was kind of hoping Gimpy was going to pay out for us there. I don't know why I decided that I needed to stay on the middle floor when I can clearly fly with them and avoid them a little bit easier. But hey, you know, it is what it is. Come on. Get up there. Thank you. We're going to replenish our hearts. Oh, shit. Kind of, kind of taking some really terrible damage, honestly. One more shot for him and he should be dead. One or two more on you. Three, whatever, close enough. And another 48 hour energy pill. Well, we leave this here because we don't really need to hang on to it. Um, this room fucking is terrible. Okay. Now you, come on. Oh, fuck you. We can actually go replace that really easily now that we have uh, some batteries, but still. Fuck you. Not a fan. Another easy room with flying. And really, it's, there's not much to say. Our run is going really, really well. There's not much to, in, in terms of talk about. I mean, like, what, what can I ask for right now? I guess what we'd really want the most at this point is to maintain damage upgrades. We're definitely, you know, better than the average we, where we would be at this particular point in the run. But I'd want something a little bit better. Something to keep us rocking and a rolling all night long. Just a rocking and a rolling while I sing this song. As long as the game is willing to continue to give me decent items, I am willing to keep on taking them. It's not like I have a choice. Well, I mean, I could turn them away, but, you know, who am I to look a gift horse in the mouth? Unless it's something really terrible like Kamikaze, then I obviously will just ignore the shit out of it. But for the most part, you know, anything it gives me, I'm going to end up taking at this point. There's no reason not to. Eee! Come on. Yeah, stay on my trail of tears my friends so we're just gonna go fight our boss and hope it's not something terribly terrible double duke of flies is actually pretty all right with our current setup especially if we're able to charm one of them unfortunately bandage girl has not been very charming as of late 
But if we can actually charm one of them, they can just deal with the other one. Ow. Terrible damage. It's fine. Hey, yeah, you get him, fly. I charmed a fly, everybody. Very exciting stuff. Let's clear out some of this bullshit. Clean it up. Does he just... Like, this particular version of Champion Duke of Flies, all he does is just, like, spawn shit? No, he gives us a spirit heart. Magic scab is fine. It's actually pretty good with the luck up, and we're just gonna move on to the next floor. It's alright. No deal with the devil yet again, which is surprising, seeing that I've taken basically no damage. It just doesn't want to give me a deal with the devil, which is, you know, it's its own prerogative. I'm not gonna force the issue. Never try and force it. But, you know, I wouldn't mind if the game decided it wanted to give me a deal with the devil. I wouldn't be adverse to the idea. Doesn't look like- I don't think we have a curse. Do we have a curse? I hope we don't have a curse. No, we do not. And it's depth, too. Again, game is being so nice. I'm a little confused. It must know that I'm not gonna play it for a, little, a few days. And is just willing to uh, play nice with me. Like, Mathis, please don't go. Please continue to play me. Look, I can be good to you. I'm good for you, my friend. We actually have to use this. Because we have to hope for a, a horseman fight. I'm sorry, game. It's just It's just not working out right now. I've got places to be. Hope that's okay with you. Even if it's not, I'm sorry. I gotta do it anyway, man. I gotta go play video games in Sweden. It happens to the best of us. Okay. One down. I was really hoping we were gonna take him out. Good. Okay. Ooh, we got a good luck up, so I'm gonna take it. That did not pay out as well as I'd hoped. Hell no. There's no need for that. Uh, super gluttony is annoying, but it's fine. Maybe it'll give us a health upgrade. Do I really want a health upgrade at this point, though? I feel like I might not even take it. Just, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna take it. I can, I can replenish my health easier with, uh... Oh, that was bad. Hang on. I gotta focus here. I can replenish my health easier with Book of Revelations. The more red hearts I get, the less uh, the less easy it becomes for me to actually replenish my health that way. So, I don't want to necessarily do that. Keeping more spirit hearts means something I can actually control a little bit. Okay, another library. Really weird. Giving me libraries like crazy lately. Let's go ahead and get these out of here. These are all pretty good except for uh, how to jump. How to jump is not good at all. I think I've only ever had to ever ever used it once, just because I was like, oh, I wonder how this works, but it's not a very good item. Alright. We do not need to use this. Oh, we can just replenish it. There we go. Can we please there we I see that's the best. Being able to clean them up just with one bomb fly kill. Satisfying. Ooh, fuck this room. Oop, fuck this room. Okay. I found pills. Doesn't do anything. Nope. Right, there's our shop and our item room, which is nice. I like how he just went across the spikes to fight his friend. Chubb, you gotta go. After, you gotta get charmed again, man. Go after your buddy. It's worth it. Fratricide? Is that what you know? Killing your brother is fratricide. It's worth it, man. There you go. Now I'm just gonna stay on this side because you tend to your AI tends to keep you on the one side. It's kind of strange, but it is what it is. Red candle, also a good pickup, but I don't know why I picked it up. It's a good pickup, but it's not really worth it. Let's see if we can just jam a bunch of money into this. Well, I hope we broke even there, because I have a feeling we didn't. Uh, I'm not picking up my reflection. Not happening. Not worth it. It can be so much better. Like, my reflection just f can fuck you so hard. It just makes fighting enemies a pain in the ass. I'm not a big fan of it. Whoa! It does something we had on Suicide King. My reflection. If you remember correctly. Yeah, we can just go to the next. There's war. So we're gonna have level 3 Bandage Girl, which we've had before. Man, this is taking a while to kill him. Yeah. Yeah, so damage ups would be great. Deal with the devil would be fantastic at this point. 
kind of sit over here, I guess. Yeah, I would like a deal with the devil. Give me something to work with here. Give me some offensive power. A little bit of, a little bit of chutzpah. A little bit of kick to our step. Any of that would be welcome. I mean, Bandage Girl is gonna be good in and of its in and of herself. That's gonna be a big help, and I do appreciate that. There's our deal with the devil. Fuck, man. Ugh, you're killing me. That is not what I want. I'll take it though. All right, Bandage Girl. You're so cute though. You're so adorable. Let's do this. Next floor. Cross of the unknown doesn't really matter. That doesn't really help. Okay. Get in there. Yeah. Chow him down. Anything? Eh. 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 Nothing. Nothing worth it. I don't know why I used Book of Revelations early on. A, we're fighting mom. B, it wouldn't have mattered because we got our level three. We got our level three uh, bandage girl here anyway, so. Let's hope not for conquest. Every time I've gone to the womb, I fought conquest. I don't know if I fought death with having Book of Revelations, honestly. So let's hope that's something that can happen. This room fucking sucks. You need to get in there, bandage girl. You need to get up in that shit. Get in there. Yeah, eat up those spiders. Oh, shit. I don't know if she can get and keep up. These things are really freaking fast. I think we're just down to spiders now. Good, we'll get that. Man, remember when Meat Boy and everything used to actually knock bombs out of the way? Those were the days. Back when they actually interacted with objects on the ground and could fuck you completely. Man, those were good times. Thanks. She's actually helping out quite a bit. No kidding. Okay, let's kill you off first. Alright, now she's not doing jack shit. Is she shooting tears? Is that something she does? Does she t shoot tears on her own? I didn't know she did that. That kind of makes her better than Meat Boy, doesn't it? Stop that nonsense. Yeah, get in there. We definitely got hit, so that'll sh that should top us off. Yeah, she does. She does shoot. That's really weird. I think that might make... I wonder if her damage on touch is actually a little bit weaker than what Meat Boy's was to compensate then. Devil card's not great, but hey. I'll hang on to it for the boss fight. She's got some range, too, man. Pretty freaking impressive. You get in there. Get him. Lick him. Kiss him. Do what you gotta do. Come on, give us something good out of these skulls. God damn it. The fool card. 20 minutes, we're a little bit late on the uh, boss rush mode. So I'm not gonna concern myself with it. Get back there. Still haven't found the item shop, so let's go fight it. Find it, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, hopefully we'll get something good out of it. Hopefully we'll get a deal with the devil. You know, all that good stuff. Actually, stay over there. Hey, hey. All right. Magic mushroom. Magic mushroom. Magic mushroom. Yeah, well, that's not good. Bad gas is meh. Bad trip is real bad. Bad gas is bad. Psst. Let's go ahead and take a liberty cap then. You know, after getting a luck up and everything, and coming back as, as Lazarus, where I believe his luck is fixed, I'm not impressed with how that went. Like, at all. Bad damage. All the way around on that room. And this room. Suddenly, Mathis starts losing control. Wow. Okay, Mathis. You gotta hang tight there, bud. You can't be doing this. Pull the reins in, my friend. The Joker card. Fuck it. Let's do it. Fuck. Uh, yeah, we'll take nine lives. I mean, there's no reason not to. Let's do that. Devil card. I mean, not like I expect to be getting any, uh, guppy action happening, but, you know, it works. It is what it is. Still no shop, no item room, surprisingly. Hopefully we'll come across it sooner rather than later. I mean, we have to be coming across it sooner rather than later. We're running out of fucking rooms. Holy shit, man. I took damage there? Oh, there's a gravity thing. I didn't even realize. Did not even realize. F 
Fool card. Yara rune is real good. Wheel of Fortune. Nah, Yara rune. I have to stick with the Yara rune. It's very clear. You know what? Boom. Give that to me. Give this to me. Fuck no. Fuck no. I'm not even gonna think about it. Humbling bundle. Absolutely. Spirit heart. Absolutely. All right, let's go fight our boss. This has been an interesting couple of floors. They haven't been great floors, let's put it that way. But they've been floors keeping us just above, like just keeping our head above water. My hope is that we'll um, have a really good deal with the devil, I guess. Uh, next floor, because we already had our deal with the devil this floor, got nine lives. But hopefully next floor we'll get a good one. Again, Bandage Girl's really keeping us what in, the, in floating right now. Just kind of going with, uh, Sacrificial dagger here. It's not a bad option, to be honest. Yeah, 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 get him. Come on. Ooh. Good, good. Good. No, oh, we already had our deal with the devil anyway. There's our uh, Polaroid. Let's go. As long as we maintain eight keys, we'll be good. And this is where you want to start thinking about maintaining your keys and not blowing them on pretty much everything. Like that. Look, playing it smart. And I'm surprised, we haven't actually had a lot of uh, damage upgrades outside the initial ones, which is not necessarily cause for concern, but definitely something to keep an eye on. I'm sorry, Why, there were four? <laughs> so, the fact that we haven't, like I said, the fact that we haven't had much in terms of damage upgrades outside of the first few rooms, which were baller out of control rooms, by the way, as you're well aware. Um, really does mean we have to be very, 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 very careful. Alright, Humbling Bundle gonna start paying off. Now we can maybe go open that golden chest and fight for it if we really want to. I don't know if we really want to, though. I don't know if I care enough. That's basically what I'm saying. I don't know what I was hoping for there, but I thought it would be fun. Come on. Tier, even though, you know what would even help? Not even necessarily a damage up, but a tears up would probably be good. Because I don't think our damage is still, you know, incredibly terrible. I mean, it's not top notch by any stretch, but I don't think it's terrible. And just a tears upgrade could really help put us in a so much better position. Let's look for a crawl space. I doubt we'll find one, but I figured I'd give it a shot. That was real bad. Uh, okay. Maybe our damage is as terrible as I thought it was initially. Hmm. I was hoping maybe I'd lose a tinted rock I didn't see. Lots of bombs being used, unfortunately. No tinted rocks in here. Start using sacrif sacrificial, sa sacrificial dagger a little bit here. That was pretty bad, but. Actually, I should have just let fucking Bandage Girl take care of it. Why didn't I think of that? I'm really hoping we fight death here, though. I don't... I'm, I'm kind of excited. I'm not going to lie. Bandage Girl, get the fuck in there. Sometimes she just don't do shit. She just kind of sits around. She's like, hey, I'm pretty. It's like, yeah, I know. You're cute. I get it. Conquest. Once again, dreams have been destroyed. A shame. A shame. Get in there, bandage girl. Do your thing, baby. Now. Deal with the devil. Krampus. Krampus. The fuck, man. Let's let her do her thing. Lump of coal. Thank you. I actually kind of could use that. This is bad. We'll just pick it up and put it down. Not that it'll come back or anything. And that was a disappointing floor. Very disappointing. But, like I've said before, all we gotta do is get to the chest, man. All we gotta do is get to the chest to make this all work. Could you not? Good. Okay. Uh, no tinted rocks at a glance. This room's alright. Yeah, go after your friend. I am your ally, I am your friend, your compadre, your companion. Let's try not to do any damage to me, shall we? Uh, I'm sorry? 
Thank God for Book of Revelations. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. Well, took advantage of the damage I took there. Make that work. You gonna go on to my Trail of Tears or something? I feel like that would be uh, nice of you. Golden chest, bring them on, baby. Give me Guppy's tail, give me something worthwhile. Yeah. No. That was so freaking close. Uh, I mean, I appreciate all this nonsense, but I don't need it. There's the boss room. So the It Lives fight could be a long one with the damage we're doing. But we just gotta hold out, man. Hold out, that's all we gotta do. Yeah, get in there. Bandage girl, get the fuck in there. Come on. Thank you. Get in there, yeah. See, when she's actually standing there, she actually does good damage. I just feel like she hasn't really done that all that much. Yeah, stay in there. Good, 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 good. All right, next floor. All right, bandage girl, you're going to be my saving grace here. No question about it. You are what I need. Mm -mm. Baby, baby, you. You are what I need. Whoa. Yeah, she charms him too. She's such a sweet pea. I wish I had the map. It's not like it's completely necessary, but I wish I had it. Let's get this open so she can get in there. Now we're gonna. Now's when we're gonna start fighting death and shit. When the game's like, "Oh, you wanted to fight death? I heard. Here you go. Have a good time with it." It's like, "Oh fuck this room. Holy shit. I do not want to deal with this nonsense. What are you gonna give me? I will bomb my way out of that room just so I don't have to deal with it. I'm telling you right now. It's not gonna happen. I don't want to deal with it." You can't fucking make me. You could give me a map. Um, I expect a health upgrade from you, though. Wow. I am, uh, I am surprised. I am not. I'm telling you right now. I'm not dealing with this fucking room. Get in there. Get in there. You gotta get in there. Come on. Get in there. Bandage girl. All you, princess. All you, you're the thing that's carrying me here. So fucking carry me. Thank you. Oh, evil ghost baby. Ooh, you killed a little one first. Very nice. Now I'll just stand right here and let you finish him off. Got a spirit heart in turn. The boss room's gotta be close. Like, we gotta be somewhere near it. And we can just get you in there and you can do God's work. Uh, I'll do it. Master of Unlocking. Is it worth it with the keys that I have? No, it's not. Not like we're gonna need them. Wow. Demon's tail. Doing a good job. Next up is Double Monstro. It's annoying. All right, get in there. Yeah, get him. Yeah, her damage is like mom's nice knife level. I respect it. It's gotta be Meat Boy. It's gotta be Meat Boy level. Like, it really has to be. It feels like it's just that fucking powerful. All right, where? There, this has gotta be the way then. Show me the way, game. Show me the way. Yeah, no, all right, you love me, remember? Don't start this nonsense with me. Come on. Yeah, that's what I want to see. Come on. Stop it with that shit. Get finished off. He had some cutesy moves, but can't withstand, okay. All right, that was bad, Mathis. That was real bad. Get in there. Thank you. Cartridge is lame. Every once in a while, I get a chance to do like the game kit effect. It's not really great. Can you can you get in here, Bandage Girl? Yeah, that works. Next one should be his face, and that should. Oh no, bullshit! It's bullshit meter going off right there. Oh, 
god, this room. Gonna, yep, I was like, I'm gonna take a hit here. Can you please not? Can you please not? Come on. How are you still fucking alive right now? Holy shit. Give me the Isaac room, baby. Come on. I don't want to play this anymore. Give me the Isaac room. So many bombs. What? Where am I? Joker card. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh my goodness. Okay. Brimstone or Death's Touch? We have, we've had Death's Touch a couple of times now. We gotta take Brimstone. Like, we have to. We haven't had Brimstone in a while, and that right there, my friends, is very much what's gonna win us this run. Pretty much, I mean, we could have called it a one run before, but this is like, bringing it to the, to the breaking point. Oh, it feels good. We haven't had Brimstone in a while, and hopefully we'll get some really cool synergies on the chest. We're actually doing really good damage with it, you know, I think, um, Lump of Coal. Definitely has something to do with that. Come on. Get in there. We have to be coming up on the goddamn boss room soon, man. Yeah. I was just gonna say. Okay, let's get Bandage Girl in there. Get in there. Give me a permanent Polaroid invincibility now. We're good. It's not that much damage, but we can make it work. I don't know why I had to think about where I was going there. Okay, nice and easy. We're definitely going to get to the chest. We're able to use our Yara rune, and hopefully things are just going to get out of control for us. Fingers crossed. Not that we need to get carried at this point, but I would like to just go at go nuts with our damage. Our damage is good. It could be better. How are you still alive? All right, let's do this. Come on, baby. Give me something good. Give me like eight good things, really. No curses, which is great. Uh, yeah. Holy Mantle's phenomenal. Little Gish is fine. No. Celtic Cross is okay. Judas's shadow is, f I mean, at this point. Robo Baby 2.0. Eh, you know, not a bad haul. Nothing that, like, immediately, like, makes us that much better. But, it's enough where it's like, you know what? This is good. Especially if we end up becoming Dark Judas. I mean, Lord knows, we don't, we probably won't die nine times to make that happen, but. That would be really good. That would, that would win it for us. No question about it. Not that we. You know, we're losing anyway. We have fucking Holy Mantle. Something we don't see very often. And getting the first hit of a room is... Fucking amazing. No question about that one. And again, I'm not gonna really worry about RoboBaby 2.0. He's good. He's really kinda cool and has very unique situations where he's like... A godsend. But nothing that really is... Uh, gonna win us the game. At this point. One down. Two down. Three down. I say that fly better be dead. Ooh. The one that just summons things, I think, so we can just sit here and be like, yeah, we got him. If we get a monster Manuel, maybe we could try and cheese up a level four bandage girl. It's a possibility. I think how many monster twos do we have right now? I don't even know. Get in there. Hurt each other. I don't like it when they're off screen. Come on. Whoop. Oh, there it is. Gimpy though, paid out. Get him. Awesome. Alright. Hopefully this is the boss room that I'm hoping for. Lots of keys, but no chest to work it on. Wow, no, the boss room isn't here. I am, uh, kind of baffled at that one, to be honest with you. I expected it to be here. 
But it is not. Ow. Well, we finished him off by only taking one hit. Made it a little bit quicker in the process. So, it was... Oh, it could be up and to the right. Let's see. No secret room there. Was hoping. Let's see if it's up and to the right then. Probably want to save Sloth for last. Might be a little bit late on that one. Well, maybe we can make it work. Oop. There we go. What do you got for me, big guy? High Priestess. It's all right. We can kind of finish off at least one of them. We're not going to get anything special. Let's go fight Blue Baby. Get in there, Blue Baby. Get in there, whatever your name is. You're not Blue Baby. Bandage Girl. And this is, like I said, it was a one run when we ended up getting Brimstone. Helped us out with the piercing shots and all that. But... We can finish him off, you know, give him some dignity, give him the dignity of the fight. Stay far away. And that's gonna be it! Well, thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you guys don't mind that there won't be any Isaac for a few days, but I'll be back at it before you know it. If you enjoyed it, drop a comment, drop a like, all that great stuff, your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.